Hey, hey, hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. It is your girl, Pamela Yvette. Hey, y'all. Coming on this good Friday, the day after Thanksgiving. So thankful to God that we're alive and, and blessed and um, highly favored. We are at the park. Um, my family and I, we're at the park. The park, we, we're at the park called Madeira Park. And I think I've done a video, uh, uploaded a video about this park one time before. It's really nice out here. It's not as um, um, hot or it's not real sunny either out here today. So we just had enjoying some family time. We got the kids in the, the background. My sister is um, getting ready to go take some pictures. And then as you can see, the one and only Kai Kai. Y'all see that? Walking around. So we kind of got the chair set up out here. And um, I'm just going to relax or whatever the case may be. And um, yeah, we're going to just enjoy our day today. Just being outside. So, as y'all know, I'm on Old Faithful, right? Get, get, get with it. Check it out. Check the video. <laughs> you can definitely see that I am doing what I do. Trying to do what I do best. Still enjoy life. Still outside. Still on my scooter. Um, <laughs> my son said cruising the street. So let me sit down for a second, y'all. Y'all know I have to hop. Hold on one second, John, before you let that go. Because he's going to drag my scooter. So, oh my God. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Y'all, I'm sorry if my son... Now, the son wants to come up in my background. So I might change it just a little bit. I may change my angle. Just because I want to, um... Hey, baby. Tell him, hey. Hey. You want, you want your water? You want to open the trunk? And then you make, bring my scooter. You see how they do? Every chance I get off my scooter, y'all, this is what happens. Somebody always confisc confiscate my scooter. Um, in my pocket. But you just, the door is open. The door is open. You can just go ahead and grab them out of there, okay? All right. So, how was everybody's Thanksgiving? How was y'all Thanksgiving? Mine was good. It was good. I ate too much, as always. Ate a lot of food. Thank you. What you think is going to hold? Oh, it's going to come right back out. You should have wrapped it on something. <laughs> they trying to, what we trying to do right now, y'all, is we trying to set Kai up. We want to make sure that Kai is, um, is going to not be able to run because, again, I'm going to be sitting over here with him. <laughs> and my, my sister, she's about to take some pictures and, you know, make a phone call real quick. And we all just going to be doing our own thing. We just posted up out here. I just want to give you guys a scenery of what we are looking at right now. You have a group of people over on the other side that's um, fishing. You know, they pull their boats in the dock. Um, you have a lot of other people around the other side, as y'all can see, um, just at picnic tables. I know my crew's probably gonna throw the football a little bit and my son's gonna be on the skateboard. As again, y'all know this is my airman right here. Airman, say hello. All right, so basically what we're doing, we're just kinda, this is, this is what it looks like for us today. It feels really good out here. Oh, you finna skate. Okay, all right. So they about to get turned up, y'all, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I just want to make sure that um I'm trying to make sure I'm all out of the way. Okay. All right. All right. So anyway, um. Mm-hmm. You know what? I may wrap it around the arm of this chair. Yeah, cause I don't want him to throw you down. But I'm gonna be watching him, y'all, just to make sure that we don't um, that he doesn't get anything in his um in his leg or anything but anyway y'all kai is enjoying this kai haven't really been out to the park he had done anything like this in a while it has been 30 plus days been over a month or so since my accident and so what's happened is is um my boy he just been kind of in the house he been homebound so any chance he gets to get outside and uh, enjoy himself he's really loving it so it's nothing like spending time with the family. This reminds me of the older, I'm not say older days because we ain't that old, but still just reminds me of the older days where uh, my kids and I we used to come out here and just on Sundays, this used to be our thing. Come out here, we get to one of the picnic tables behind me. Oh, hand me my drink. 
Y'all forgot about my drink. But we would get at one of the picnic tables behind me over there. And um, we play games. Hey, Joel, come back up this way because somebody driving a boat ramp thing back up here. Thank you. And um, for those of you that live in Florida, y'all already know, we stopped by Wawa and got a drink. And Wawa is a convenience store. And this is my first time trying a um a chai tea cold or whatever. This is really good. I always have like a um, chai tea that is warm, something that you get from the store. So this is something that I really think is good. And I'm enjoying it. So it's not too cold out here. It feels good. So I'm going to put this up here real quick. Y'all check my son out. Kyle's about to go crazy because he wants to get with my son so bad. My son's on his skates. Kai Kai! Come here, big boy. I should have brought we should have brought him some treats. Cause he really mad that he can't get. <laughs> he wanna he wanna get over there so bad with my son. <laughs> Kai just wanna run free. But the thing about Kai is, y'all, there's there's alligators out here. I ain't even gonna try the front of uh, a car coming, Jalen. I'm not even gonna try the front and act like I'm not trying to front and act like it's just a free range out here because it's not. We don't allow Kai to just run free out here because I know sometimes he's not as obedient as he needs to be. And so in order for him to do, let me get you up here. Uh-oh, uh-oh, big boy. Uh-oh, it's okay. I want my I want my son to be able to enjoy himself. So, yeah, say hey, Kai Kai. Say hey, baby. Jayla, watch out. Say hey. Say hi. <laughs> so he's having a field day so he's just enjoying himself and um he ain't really enjoying himself he want to get free as you can see him he going crazy because he want to <laughs> he want to get free y'all but i can't let him get down only because there's cars as you can see cars are passing by people are leaving out because you know family this is like a family type park people come out here getting their boats they go fishing, they skate, they skateboard, you know, they ride their, their bikes and things out here. We really, we normally um ride or do a lot of walking, walking the trails and everything. On the other side, um behind me back there, y'all, that's where a lot of people go camping at. So there's a lot of things to do out here. And the name of this park is called um Madeira Park. That's what we come to. So Kai Kai, Kai Kai, it's okay. He can't stand to see my son just going and doing. You're going to hold him. He can't stand to see you going and leaving him. Look at him, y'all. Now he happy. Kai, you're such a baby. But we can't trust you, big boy. We... He wanted to chase Jalen so bad, but I'm afraid that he may not. He keeps, he likes to do a little. This is the thing with Kai. He likes to chase them, but then he get in his mind he want to be chased. And then he just keeps running, and I don't want him to run over on that side because over on that side is where the actual water is. Um, a couple years ago, we went, uh-oh. A couple of years ago, we went canoeing out here. Y'all, that was the most scariest thing I ever done. God, thank you for sparing my life. Me, the kids, all of us, my boyfriend, all of us went um, canoeing. <laughs> And y'all, every time I saw an alligator, it drove me insane because the alligator would, when he would see us, Kai is so upset that he can't go, y'all, excuse me. But anyway, the alligator would see us, y'all. He'd be riding up on the side of the canoe. I didn't tie it over there. We He'd be riding up side of the canoe, and all of a sudden he goes down. Oh, yeah, homie, you got like me like me. Lord, let me tell y'all something. If you ain't never been scared like that, it's scary when you it's can see a, a freaking alligator riding beside you or floating beside you while you in a canoe. <laughs> he made Jay fall. <laughs> Juwan, watch out because there's a car coming. Come here, big boy. Y'all come back over this way so he don't be entertained. I mean, he won't have the, the urge to go out there. Y'all, here we were thinking it was a good idea. We probably should have left Kai behind at home so the kids could enjoy themselves. Yeah. yeah it's, it's secure. I can't okay. I just feel like I want to hold it still, I just because. Okay. How about this? I put it underneath my leg, y'all, because we still. You can't get right this big meat, y'all. Hmm. You're gonna have to do a lot of fighting to get this. Look, this leash. I keep telling myself I want to make sure that I, um, 
have the leash around my leg, so I don't want no problems. <laughs> but anyway, I am enjoying my day. Um, Thanksgiving was nice. Let me go back to the alligator story. That's y'all. Forgive me. My train of thought is crazy. But anyway, so freaking alligator, y'all. We was on the canoe. Lord Jesus. On the canoe, we out here minding our own business because at the time it was my boyfriend and I in the boat, right? We just chilling. I'm already scared as I don't know why I did not want to go in the boat or in the canoe because I've already, I, at the time I didn't know how to swim. I know how to swim now. So since I moved to Florida, I know how to swim. Go figure. But anyway, so we riding, alligators are so freaking big, y'all. Riding up against us. I mean, they just kind of floating by us. And so I think they were just nervous and trying to, well, they were nosy. They're trying to see who this is in the water, right? Who this is, Hoppo? Okay. So they come, do a little drive-by, figure out, okay, those humans or whatever, whoever they are, they don't pose a threat, I guess. The moment they decide they, we didn't pose a threat to them, that's when they submerge themselves underwater. Right then and there, y'all, I started bracing myself because I was like, Lord, please, don't let this thing flip me over. Please, I was just embracing myself for it for us to be flipped over. Once I knew once we got flipped over, it was over with. <laughs> But, glory be to God, I won't ever do anything that stupid again in, in life. So, that's that's one of my little testimonies. Uh-oh, how I feel like we have played with death. We've been playing. Who could, don't let them down. We've been playing with danger and death for a lot of time, for a lot of years. But, um, yeah, this is, that was the, by far the craziest time. But, anyway, I think my kids are doing a race. You want me to hold them? I think the boys are going to do a race. And my sister, she's trying to, um... She trying to check them out. Look at my daughter, y'all. She just being crazy. But anyway, so I think <laughs> they enjoying their auntie. And this is such a blessing, y'all, because I got all my, I haven't had all my kids in, in one spot in a while. So I'm grateful for that. So I guess they're going to get ready to do a race or something. I don't know, y'all. I'm just, I'm always here. My kids are so competitive with each other, y'all. Always. So, this is fun. Like this, however, for you, young, just make sure this, I need a good shot once you pass this point. Hey, boo, watch out. Alright y'all, so y'all about to see these knuckleheads race. Oh, I thought he was racing. Okay, I'm sorry y'all, I lied. Kai, calm down, please, please. Get it together, Kai Kai. Listen, you can't go everywhere they go, okay? Will you stay with mommy? Kai, it's okay. Kai don't want anybody to have any fun for themselves for the day. Oh shoot, Kai, you making my leg hurt, so I gotta prop my leg up. But anyway, y'all, y'all see? Um, thank God I don't have to have a sock on today. Look at them two, y'all. Kai, y'all know what? I think the next time we're gonna leave Kai home. Even though this is a nice a video, it's a good gesture. Kai, 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 stop it. He just tearing me up, y'all. And the sun coming. But anyway, Jaylen, get him, please. This man is fighting. He fighting to get away from me, y'all. Go figure. So this is what I am, y'all. I'm sitting here at the scooter. I'm chilling. Got my scooter right here. Got my foot propped up. So, Jaylen, yes, he knew my toes, y'all, thank God. Right go. Swelling goes so in, so swelling goes like up and down, so thankful for that. And, um, yeah, I'm good. I'm just kind of chilling. My shoe is so freaking nasty, y'all. And this is another thing that I've learned, too. My leg, so ashy. I can't, because I do a lot of, um, you know, when I take my bath and everything, or my, my, my bath, I'll say, um, when I take my, um, you know, once I'm done, I'm noticing that my skin is so dry on both feet. At first, I thought it was my right foot that was just 
cutting up on me because it swells up it gets real big and then it goes back down like to normal size i thought maybe because my skin is being stretched to the max that it was i was thinking that it was just um normal to be honest but i don't know now at this point my other leg gets real scaly this one gets dry too i put vaseline i put um jergens lotion i always try to put moisturizing lotion and stuff on me and I still end up being real scaly. I don't know. And I drink a lot of water. So I don't know what's going on. But I noticed this since I had, I've had the, um, my accident, since I've had surgery, my skin is so freaking dry. And I, maybe it's because of the medication that I took. Um, maybe it was probably because of the, um, you know, the pain meds and all that stuff that I was on. Cause I was on two different type of pain meds. I don't know. Plus, I had the nerve block. Something I feel like my body's allergic to, and my skin has just turned to like a, a, a snake or whatever. Um, and I'm sorry, y'all, if y'all hear Kai in the background, because he is so, he's annoyed at the fact that we're not letting him get down. Kai Kai, it's okay. My daughter is having to hold him just so he won't be in the way. So, basically, this is him, right? Just in case if y'all see him, he's just mad at the fact that what's going on over there, he can't be a part of it. Kai is typically a little boy for real. Look at him. <laughs> He's trying to bite his leash away. <laughs> okay. Well, all right, y'all. I am going to go and get off of this um, video. Cause, plus, the sun is coming back out, y'all. The sun is coming back out, and I don't want to blind y'all with this light. Again, if you have a, a Wawa in your area, it's chai tea. It's hitting. If you like chai tea, y'all. If you like spicy type, like all spice or scent, nutmeg, that type, those type of flavors, I like that. So it doesn't bother me. Look at him. He's a big baby, y'all. Look at him. That's all he want. Look at him. He happy now. But no, he may not be excited because he see Jalep still over there. See, he gonna go after him, but now he's gonna get upset. Hey, Jalep, watch your back, man, because somebody's pulling out. And that's another thing you have to always be mindful of your back uh oh you have to be mindful of um watching your back out here because people you know they're driving in and out through the park okay all right well i hope and pray that everybody's having a great day so far kai kai come here big boy he's trying to bite through the leash i hope and pray that you're having a wonderful day me y'all see me my day is all over the place just we got so much stuff going on we are having a, a blast just being out of the house so i hope and pray that you guys enjoy your thanksgiving number one number two hope and pray that you guys didn't eat too much like me and three i hope you guys are living life to the fullest for those of you who got those ankle injuries or any type of injuries where you feeling like you limited to doing things <laughs> Trust your girl still out here in these streets doing stuff because I ain't finna let nothing stop me, okay? Remember, you see this? What? He got a dog out there, he ain't on the leash. Okay, a dog on the leash? All right, y'all, he ain't on the leash. Let me get up. He a German Shepherd. Okay, so y'all try to say I'm the weakest link. I'm gonna be the one to get taken down. I'm not the weakest link. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's a dog, y'all, not on the leash. Here they warning me, right? Hey. They'll call their dog back when you when they Yeah, they'll call their dog back. Pooka going and she already know what it is. I got that one here the quarter. <laughs> my, I ain't even gonna hide. My baby gonna handle that. She run towards Yeah, yeah, yeah. We hey we, he let me tell y'all. Your girl already done took a hit. What I look like taking another one? Uh-uh. I already done taking a hit. So what I look like? You see this leg? And you see this? I'm not even gonna try to get up. I just hope and pray that they put their dog, you know, because we got our dog kind of on the leash and harness. So we don't want to get eaten up out here, y'all, for real. But my baby went to the car. She was like, Mom, I'm about to grab something. So, yeah, it's just a big German Shepherd behind us. They were just trying to let us know they over there. In case y'all can see back there. It's all kind of stuff over there, y'all. So, anyway. Anyway, hope and pray you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. I'm sorry for rambling, y'all. Y'all know me. I rant and ramble all day. But at the end of the day, have a wonderful one. I will see you on the next video. Now, before I go, I want to say this. If you guys are new and you just so happen to discover my channel, thank you so much for clicking on the video to watch. I hope and pray that I've said something. I've done something to inspire, to uplift, and encourage you guys. 
if you are new to the channel please subscribe hit the thumbs up i welcome you um again i can't stress this enough i'm new to the youtube world i started this after my mom passed away back in august and this has been my life and i'm just determined to try to uplift and encourage those and this injury right here has really inspired me to just say you know what pam you got to get out of your head you got to get out of your head and stop crying and moping around and trying to let the devil make you depressed get out of all that so that's what made me start doing these videos y'all because it is helping me because i'm getting the noise out of my head and it's helping me to um to live life and move on okay all right well love you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and i shall talk to you later bye bye